regular yung sinutons ko today. So, for verification po, ma'am, ask ko lang po yung name mo. I'm Jennifer Faustin. So, yung birthday niyo po? April 5, 1975. So, yung age niyo po? 47. So, for today, ma'am, I will be assessing your appearance, mental status, skin, and hair. So, can I ask your consent po kung pwede po hawakan yung certain parts of your body? Yeah, it's okay. So, rest assured naman po na lahat ng documents naman na nags ko po here is complete confidential po. So, before I start, I already performed a proper hand washing and now I will be sanitizing my hand using alcohol. So, in this assessment po, I will make sure that all of the curtains and doors are closed in order to provide you privacy all throughout of the procedure. So, ma'am, may I know your general health status po? So, kamusta naman po kayo? May masakit po ba sa inyo? Uh, as of now, wala nyo. So, susukat po yung kayo po, ma'am. Ay, po. So, I observe quite few moles 
sa arms po and sa face niya naman po is light lang po. And meron din po ako napans napansin na um, skin break lang po. Like, yung... Ano po? Ano po? Ano po? Ano po? Ano So, yun, napansin ko rin po na meron po yung last sa half part of your cheeks po sa inyong face. So, next po, I'm going to palpate the textures of your... The te texture. So, next po, I'm going to palpate the texture of your skin po. Can you please hand in your arms po again? So, ma'am, there are no present um, um, scratch or stretch mark po in your arms. So next po, I'm going to palpate your temperature using the dorsal part of my hand po. So I have observed po that your skin is warm, hindi po gaano kainit po, and no indications of fever po. Also po, the moisture of your skin, hindi naman po siya dry or oily, moist lang po siya and that's good to know po. So next po, I will be assessing your regular of your skin po, which lang po siya sa may kamay. So, okay naman po. Normal din po nung pinis ko po siya. May mobility naman po. Ayun, bumabalik naman po siya. Wala po siyang sign of dehydration. So now ma'am, I will be assessing for the hair po. So now, I will be doing physical examinations and maaari ko po bang tignan ang buhok nyo para ma-examine po natin yung kabuoan ng buong katawan nyo po as part of your physical exam po. So, ano po ba ang pangalan ninyo? Jennifer Faustino. Edad nyo po? 47. And ma'am, is it okay with you po if I examine your hair? Okay lang. So now, I will be introducing the materials po which are the gloves and then, and then, which are the gloves and then the alcohol po. So, I will provide for your um, privacy po, ma'am. I will put the curtains and then lock. So, ma'am, I have questions po before we start the examination po. Do you have, uh, do you try to, to straighten your hair po? Yes. Or, nagpakulunin po ba kayo hair? Yes. When was the last time po? Last month. So, do you experience po the chemotherapy or not? No. So, do you have history po ng hypothyroidism po? No. So, ma'am, I will be starting to check your hair. So, ma'am, so now I will be performing a hand hygiene po, which, which I will use alcohol and start loving. So, ma'am, I will be starting to check your hair po. Um, I will check the scalp po, ma'am. So, ayan po, kayo naman po, wala naman po sign ng pagkal po sa ibang part ng inyong scalp. And tinignan ko rin po kung makapal or manipis yung texture and oiliness po. May slightly pagkalipis lang po yung hair nyo. And texture po at oiliness, wala naman po. Um, tama lang po siya, hindi dry and oily. So, to check ko po yung hairline nyo sa ilalim ng tenga. Wala naman po problema, malinis naman po, maganda naman po ang inyong buho. And then yung amount naman po ng body hair nyo sa braso. And then sa inyong legs. So, so, yung amount naman po ng body hair nyo sa arms and legs nyo naman po is normal. So, ayun po ma'am, I will document all of the findings po sa inyo and there is no infestation po sa hair nyo, no dandruff and I will be documenting all the gathered data po. So this is the end of our return demonstration. Again, my name is Tiffany Faustino, student nurse and thank you. God bless po.